Hey guys, this is Foolish Mortal back with some more. Yeah, very smirky. Yeah, okay. Uh, back with some more uh, World of Warcraft with Valene, um, our warlock, and we're over here in uh, Venom's Bite, uh, talking to Ag High Exeter Roth. You were sent from Agmar's Hammer. It's about time. No, the help is not for me. I simply have no one else to spare. But you'll do. Our time. The conquest hold, but be careful. I received a request for help from our base in the Grizzly Hills. No. Be we'll go on and accept it just to get it off her. I think this is all onslaught. I am forsaken. If you read the one poster, what is the high executor thinking? Vicky looks around and continues in hushed tones. We can't very well have those scarlet onslaught idiots. Being raised by their priest, or worse, raising as the scourge, now can we? Now I'm in total agreement with you. We have to do something about the corpses. Uh, I have just the thing. Take this blight that we just created and test it on the prisoner in the cage here. Victory right. for Sylvanas. I mean, he's a human. It's not like uh, he actually... We actually care. I'm listening. What? That's impossible. We've perfected the blight. It has a 100% lethality. The apothecary wrings her hands, a concern crossing her unliving visage. Clearly frustrated, she continues in an angry tone. This is just really odd. Hand me that flask, Warlock. I'm not going to be known as the apothecary that have ruined everything. Beware the living. Don't understand it. The blight should have worked. No sense worrying about it now. The apothecary seems relieved for some reason. Though it doesn't work on the onslaught for some strange reason, we still need to keep their priest from raising them. I have another idea, one that their corpses shouldn't have any protection from. Flynn, take a container of my rats and unleash them upon any onslaught corpses you come across at New Hearth Glen. I starved the women, so they should be voracious. Our time well, since we're going over there, we're going to take this one. Kill 20 members of the Scarlet Onslaught. Okay. And then this guy's got a, a Scarlet Onslaught. Onslaught quest. Speak quickly. Funding the war effort. The Quartermaster lowers his voice and whispers to you. Warlock, I need your help. Our coffers are empty. The Korkron Vanguard at the Wrath Gate taken all of our corn coin for the fight there. But I've heard whispers that there's treasure to be had amongst the wrecks on the Forgotten Shore. Uh, yeah, we can do that. We can slide too far out of the way. Ah, good news. Ah, good new meat. Do you wish to prove yourself? The Scarlet Onslaught, the most zealous and racist of the Scarlet Crusade, are in our backyard to the south. If, if we're going to fight them, we'll need more armor and weapons than I can make in such a short time. Why don't we take theirs? More to the point, why don't you take theirs? Remember, patience. Oh, Whoop. So we'll go grab these real quick. That should not take long. Because we've already done, uh, I think we've already done one side quest over here. So I'm, I've been thinking about uh, a different uh, uh, transmog. I was wondering what you guys would, <clears throat> if you all had any ideas for something a little different. Uh, of course, this is uh, classic uh, uh, tier one.
the um, Felhart uh, set. So, and there's there's a lot of uh, uh, pretty interesting um, gear sets out there. Um, So if you guys uh, would have anything that you would want me to farm, and, and I would definitely show that on on camera. Uh, I had a pretty good response to my uh, uh, showing the farming run in Mountain Core and uh, uh, some of the other farming that I did. So that was, I enjoyed that. I don't know if we'll do all of these over here because they, they are a little time consuming, but we're getting really good experience from them. I don't think the horses count. So that's pretty much what we're going to be doing. Uh, so I'm actually going to pause the video and, uh, <clears throat> and go on and kill the rest of these guys and uh, pick their corpses clean and uh, grab this stuff up here. If uh, I don't think there's any um, uh, quest, uh, quest items or drops. So... So I'm going to pause the video and I'll be right back. Okay, we're back. Uh, and I accidentally, um, right after I paused the video, I leveled up. And I unlocked um, uh, Gundrak. So, um, so we're going to go on and get these turned in. And, um, <clears throat> and do um, a few more quests. And then on the next video... I'm going to queue up for a dungeon and see how my DPS is. What would you ask of death? Mm, no. Beware. Your enemy is about. Uh, honored with Warsaw. Nice. You do not smell so fresh now, new mate. Very well. All of this will do. But what name might I call you, Warlock? Farewell. Hello. Hello, I'm Hansel. Pleased to meet you. The High Exeter came to me and said, Hansel, I want you to get us new mounts. Where does he think Dread Steeds come from? The ground? Whispering, actually, they do, if you can find a horse graveyard. We don't have one of those, so, so what we need you to do is go south to New Hearthglen, 
kill the knights and take their riding crops and steal their war horses. Farewell. This is fairly fun. So. What will we require? Oh good, for a moment I thought I was going to have to test the rats out on someone to make sure that they weren't defective. Progress! Finally! Uh... Yeah, I don't want to lose crit. Beware. Our enemy is I'm listening. Uh, very well done, Blood Elf. I trust that you are cleverly vicious in your slaying. Victory for someone Death Guard, Molder, Molder. Uh, Stealing from the Siege Smiths. Say, I think that's um, about that area. I thought I'd picked up that quest. Aha! Yes. We have more fools for you to kill. My agents tell me that several of our good citizens have seen fit to fall into the hands of the Scarlet Onslaught. Uh, you know, I don't, don't want to do that, I don't want to do that anymore. You know, actually, yeah, let's do that. Um, that ha that has a pretty interesting outcome. What is it? you do is you you can tab target between the knight and the war horse and you just basically want to kill the knight come on die you can do it and then you loot that click on the horse So that's not too difficult. So you can see we're we're quite a bit higher than the uh speak quickly. Oh wait, there we go. Leave vehicle. Uh did I get credit for that one? And you uh Why didn't that one, uh... Well, that should have, uh, credited me one. Credited me one. I've got a. I hate when quests do that. It's like, oh no, you didn't push the exact right button. Oh well. At least it's not as bad as whatever quest used to make you do. Holy cow. I'm listening. There we go. Yeah, every quest, there were some quests in there. Uh, and of course, there wasn't really a quest log. Back in uh, OG uh, EQ, <laughs> so to speak, and um, <clears throat> so you would have uh, you just kind of have to remember uh, who you were farming what item for, 
<clears throat> and then when you went for a turn in, instead of just clicking on the person and turning it in, you had to physically pull out each individual um, item. And if it were, um, say, you had to give four bat wings to somebody, what do you require? Um, you had to, um, like, a little turn in window would pop open and you had to turn in each one in each slot. Uh, so if you tried to turn in like four at a time, uh, like you would only get credit for one. <laughs> and it was very frustrating. Uh, but I think they changed that for some of the quests, but not all of them. Uh, so like I said, I... Um, oh, leaving you in the dust, buddy. So, yeah, like I said, I, I still occasionally play some EverQuest, but it's uh, really very dull to watch. <laughs> the pacing is and you, uh, very, very slow. What do you require? Uh, nothing makes me happier than a job well done. You've done Venom Spider great service. Beware. You know, actually, I can use those mounts, so... I think I'm actually, uh... Exal well, I mean, I've gotten exalted with all of the factions in the past, so... Oh good, you're here to rescue me. Now let me out of here. Uh, not today. Aw, oh. oh, poor guy. Yeah, the, uh... Um, the, uh, Forsaken are not very forgiving. No. Goodbye. <laughs> That's still recharging. <laughs> I can't pass that yet. <laughs> yeah, that just doesn't do very much damage. Yeah, I mean, it's just like a very, very minute amount. A flying mount makes these these uh, quests incredibly easy. What is it? And there we go. It's 
We're gonna scoot on back to Venom's Pike. Oh, excuse me. Oh. Hope everybody's enjoying the uh, the summer so far. It's uh, it's actually uh, July third. Uh, we're doing a little bit of recording. Uh, I actually got a few days off work. Oh, I drove drove flew right past it. What? You're expecting us to have you rescue them? Now why would we want to do that when they were have a proven track record of getting themselves captured in the first place? Northrend is a cold place, young Valene. I suggest you adjust to it. Enough. I want you to put an end to the torture of my people. The Onslaught's torturer, LeCraft, has been bleeding information out of everyone who gets caught by these fiends. I need to know what they know. My sources tell me that he has set up shop in the basement of their barracks, which is right next to the smithy. I'll loan you my personal branding iron and see to it that the job is done right. Ooh. Goodbye. I know flying through these trees is just absolutely riveting gameplay, so... We killed him before we could question any. Oh well. A rod drops from LeCraft's dead hand. There are pulsing magical runes along its length. Could this be how he was getting his confessions? Better let the High Executor have a look at it. still got a questioning. Uh, so now we've got to wait for him to respawn and actually poke him before we kill him. I think he respawns pretty rapidly. Wait, wait. What was that you want to know? I know you're a warlock named Valene. No, no, no. Don't kill me. Oh no, we know what you've been stealing our armor and weapons and horses. Uh, we know that what that you don't know why we're immune to your so-called blight. Uh, Grand Admiral Westwind somehow gave the High Abbot that prayer. I beg you no more, please. Ah, uh, please, we know that you have a spy disguised as one of us. There, that's all I know. Please, Mercy, stop. Mercy's for the weak. Excuse me. So yeah, we're uh, making pretty rapid progress. I'm definitely going to have to save up some uh, some money and buy some uh, tokens to upgrade my armor uh, when we get into. Uh, They knew all of that? And who the hell is this Grand Admiral Westwind that he spoke of? 
the high executor grumbles to himself about hating surprises. Better that we know than have to guess. I hope that you have left your uh, my mark. Dark lady, watch over you. The craft had it, you say? Well, that makes sense. I recognize it from my youthful days as a torturer in the court of King Tyrannus of Fallen Lordaeron. It's known as the Rod of Compulsion. The High Exeter wrings his hands together in evil anticipation of what's to come. I have an idea for how we can make good use of it. Honored with Hand of Vengeance. Nice. It's time for us to utterly demoralize the Onslaught forces. I want you to take the Rod and use it on four of their leaders. Commander Jordan, upstairs at the barracks. Lead Cannoneer Zerhut down the southeast ramp overlooking the beach. Blacksmith Goodman at the smithy and Stablemaster Mercer at the stables. Place them under the rod's compulsion. Concentrate on them, making them denounce the onslaught and then kill them. Oh, that's kind of cool looking. time we got. Um, we might be able to get it done in time. Uh, blacksmith. I think we've killed him in the before, so. I guess it's kind of like the Paladin Hammer. Maybe I don't. Well, I guess we, uh, I guess only affliction gets health funnel. Where? Yeah, that's the uh, the thing with affliction. It doesn't have like a like any burst damage really. Um. That's still recharging. <clears throat> Whereas um, some of the other um, specs kind of can do um, like on demand large dam large amounts of damage. But now uh, when it comes to single target. Damage uh, on bosses. Uh, uh, affliction really can uh, rack it up because they're just they're constantly doing damage. Uh, Commander Jordan, yeah. Well, 
I was hoping to be done before my 30 minutes were up, but I don't think I'm going to quite make it. Yeah, I better go on and uh, stop the video. Uh, I know, I might, well, we'll just go for a few minutes. This guy should be right down this uh, path right down here. So I'm going to fly back uh, and uh, get ready to turn that in. And I'm probably going to go on and queue up for a dungeon, and I will see you guys in the next video. Uh, thanks for watching.